guys, it's uh, February 28th, 2019, 2.41 p.m. I am posting this a little bit earlier because I have to uh, do a lot of stuff today. Um, I did this cartoon after I ate dinner last night. I thought, you know what? I'm really, really tired. It's about time for my nap. It's 10 p.m. So, you know what? Let me go ahead and do this cartoon and maybe try to change my sleep schedule a little bit over the next couple of days since I got to do all this work that's going to come through around 5, which I already started on. Um, I woke up about, well, I went to sleep about 6.30 this morning. I procrastinated during this cartoon like crazy. And uh, I, 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 I had Hillary proofread it before 11. Then I had a long chat with her, which was more procrastinating. And uh, she's sending me some candles. Or some smelts, whatever that, those are. And uh, I know what they are, she told me. And before everyone tells me. And uh, I went to sleep about 6.30, woke up about 10 a.m. and started going. I went back to work. This cartoon is doing pretty well on social media. We, we got close to 300 shares so far. Yesterday's did not do as well. I um, I watched most of the hearings. I didn't watch all of it. Um, and while I was working last night, the news came in from Vietnam that there's no deal in North Korea, with North Korea, which proves that that first deal they signed at the first summit was just a bunch of horse shit. <laughs> which we already knew that. There was nothing on it. There's no guarantees. We're going to try this. We're going to try that. We're going to try this. Blah, 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 blah. Um, but it's funny to me that during this Michael Cohen testimony that Republicans spent the entire time attacking Cohen without ever defending Trump. When they did try, they, they did the black friend defense. Look, look, Donald Trump has a black friend, so he can't be racist. And then the guy that used a black woman as a prop defended himself for being racist by saying he has black friends. <laughs> That's another cartoon right there. I don't know if I'll even get to it. But Republicans are forgetting what Michael Cohen I mean, they're right. Michael Cohen is a liar. He's a convicted perjurer. He's going to prison. But they don't talk about what he lied about or who he lied for. One Republican anonymously, anonymously, anonymous, anonymous, anonymously told the Washington Post that they didn't defend, defend Trump because he's indefensible. So, this is Jim Jordan. I was looking at photos of him how to draw him and while I was looking at photos a puppet showed up of him and it looked more like a, a Muppet Muppet and uh, I didn't use that for the caricature but it just it looks so much like him uh, I, I just used this photo and uh, I did spend more time this cartoon than I recorded here because uh, I drew Matt Gates like a thousand times a lot of times. It took me a long time before I was happy with it. And I, I've drawn him once before in the past, but that time I drew him with like six other people and his face caricature was a lot smaller. One of my clients who has him as a congressman asked me if this was the first time I'd drawn him. But I was like, nope. I don't think they were my clients when I drew him last time. Um, yeah, see right there? They don't look like him at all. He's terrible. He looks kind of like a Kennedy. Uh, fucked to Matt Damon and it didn't work out well. Um... <laughs> I did not plan to say that. I'm so sorry. Let's do some shout outs before we're out of time because we're only like we're less than eight minutes today. Robert Cotino says, What is this life of which you speak of? See, Robert Cotino gets it. He understands. And congrats, congratulating me on the CNN work. I hope those paychecks keep coming for you. Me too. Um, whenever they do start coming in. Uh, Cotino says, I actually hate what Maduro and his government are doing to their people. What kind of asshole would purposely starve his own people? Probably the same kind of asshole that would, that would throw children in cages because it makes his base feel good. You know, that's what I think. Uh, Emily says, please, please, please sing the Welcome Back Cotter song to me. That would make my day, and I promise to watch more videos. Good luck with the housemate situation. I hope things work out. Let me do. Um, I am not going to sing that song, at least not yet. Maybe I'll look at it. But the thing is, if I look it up, the chords, which I can probably figure it out. It's going to be stuck in my head for like a week. And why would you want to do that to me, Emily? Why? Why? But I do want you to keep coming back and commenting, so maybe I'll do it for you. Hayes Eaglets, how you doing? Thanks for coming in and commenting. Here's your shout out, Hayes Eaglets. Uh, Hayes Eaglets wrote, who is also a 76ers fan, must be in Philly, or you like Philly. The irony about Trump is that bone spurs and all, he finally did go to Vietnam. Yes, that is true irony. And, uh, and he got shot down in Vietnam too. <laughs> That's not my joke. I saw that on social media. Um, 
Tristan Oso said, working for CNN. Congratulations. Cool cartoon as always. I made a new cartoon. It's called Stable Genius. Please check it out. It is Layla. Layla, you got me on my knees. Layla. I don't know what that means, but I'll, I'll try to go check it out if I get a moment. I, I actually have another idea for CNN that I need to sketch. I, I, I have sketched out four, I believe so far and they're gonna call me about five and probably change that the entire direction that i've been going in but actually i have a funny feeling they're gonna take the very first one that i sketched i haven't sent them to them yet i'm gonna wait till they call me and then i'm gonna i'm gonna overwhelm them <laughs> hang on oh god why did we ever hire this guy with this look at all these guys dance. they all suck <laughs> I have received a few uh, compliments on my caricatures in this cartoon. I like the way I draw Michael Cohen, and I think a few other cartoonists out there are drawing him really, really well. I When I looked up Matt Gates' photo, this uh, car, bunch of cartoons of him came up from this one cartoonist in North Florida, and none, not once, has that guy drawn Matt Gates look like Matt Gates. Not once. It just don't look like him at all. It's like, put some effort into it. And I'm not saying that my caricature of him is great. I know I'm going to get on the shot. I hope I do. But damn. <laughs> Gates uh, sent out a uh, witness intimidation to uh, Cohen the night before he testified. And you, you think Cohen's a really, really dumb lawyer. Gates is a lawyer. So we might have actually found one dumber than Michael Cohen. Um, now Florida's looking to disbar the guy. Maybe. Look at that. Here's the rough. I remember to do it. Yay! Here's the cartoon, folks, and it's done. Please leave a comment for me, and I will give you a shout out. I will say your name on the YouTube, and click that red button for me. If you click the red button, I'll be so happy, so happy. Go check out President Oso's uh, page and his cartoons. Okay, his videos. They're quirky. They're really cool, and they're short. So you'll dig them. Subscribe to his channel while you subscribe to mine. Goodbye, folks. I will see you all on Friday, and I'll record the CNN cartoon for you. Goodbye.